Hello everyone, of course I'm John Doe right here in Tokyo, Japan. And we're going to do another edition of the Ghost Letters Report. Now I thought now is a good time to finally talk about one of the more extreme effects of social alienation here in Japan. It's a phenomenon known as the Hikikomare. It's someone who becomes an extreme hermit. They shut themselves off from all of society, uh, sometimes locking themselves in their own home, and in more extreme cases, locking themselves in their own room, refusing to come out, even for food. And it can go on for years. Years and years and years and years and years of someone living like this. Now, you may be wondering, what could cause something like that? What could cause such an extreme reaction to social alienation? Let's look into this a bit, right? It mostly affects young people. And a lot of the cases happen where someone is unable to keep up with the strict, rigid demands of academic, scholastic achievement and social acceptance, social harmony, as they call it in Japan. Because as you go through school and you grow up, you're basically like, Education is your life, you know, a lot of times. You're really focused on having to study, study, study. Compete for your other classmates for um, achievements, to get ahead. It's very competitive. And to even get into high school in Japan, you have to compete. High school is not mandatory in Japan. So you have to take a test to get accepted to a high school. And depending, depending on which high school you get accepted to, that can affect your future endeavor, try to go to college, or otherwise in life. So a lot of competition there. Now what happens here, you have people who fall through the cracks. People who are unable to keep up. And second chances in this type of environment are, are rare, non-existent. Once you are able to, once you fail to keep up with everyone else, the pressure that comes on you socially is rather extreme in Japan. You're ridiculed, you're heckled, you're bullied, you're told you're shit, and you hear that all the time. And all your friends are moving beyond you. They just leave you behind. You know, there's no like um, support system for people who fall behind. You know, now in some cases these people become neats or even freeders. And in rare cases, you find someone who does find their kind of niche in life. And they are kind of find what best, best suits them. And they're able to adjust to it. But that's not the case for everyone. Because I have a hikikomura. Yeah. Now think about this. We have a society here where if you don't keep up with what's expected of you, if you don't, you're unable to fall in line with the bourgeois narrow idea of what you, the worker, should be and become, you're cast away and you're bullied and intimidated to the point where you're so humiliated and demoralized that you lock yourself off from the rest of society and you basically just wait to die. You know, play a video game. You just sit in your room by yourself alone all the time. That's really extreme type of reaction to social alienation. When I see that going on here in Japan, it just kind of makes me think there's something seriously wrong with the social structure here. When you have that going on, on such a level that actually has a name and can be identified, you know, and these people really are suffering. They're so disconnected from their fellow human beings due to this extreme competition, due to this extreme pressure and intimidation, that they can't even connect with their fellow human beings because they're not allowed to. They're not allowed to be a human being and connect in a real meaningful way. It's all about study and competition and fight it out and who's going to be the, the king of the hill. You know? And if you fall too far down low, well, you get kicked away. And you're told, you know, you know go die. You know. I thought I'd bring this up. 
because I think it's something that's not talked about enough in Japan due to the social stigma associated with it. A lot of family just kind of like are happy if that person locks themselves away and it becomes like a dirty little family secret. So I think it's good to bring light to this. I want to hear what you think about this in the comment section below. First time you see me, I subscribe is always appreciated. I try to do lots of stuff like this, like newsy stuff, social commentary, protest vids, union, union act, labor union activity, all kinds of neat little things. So until next time, this is me, John Doe, here in Tokyo. Check it out.